Hello everyone, my name is Felix and in this video I will be demonstrating how to join attribute tables in QGIS. I have already imported a data for a particular station and these two data I have here the first one is temperature data and the second one is station data in order to join attribute tables the two tables need to have something in common and I will be checking the attribute table for these two and then we can see what these two data files contain so for the temperature data I have stations I have the year and I have the temperature so kindly remember these three and then I will as well open the attribute table for the stations and then we see what they have in common the station has station altitude and the name so you can see from the first one that these two have station in common so that is the uh, that is the column we will be joining okay so what we need to do is in my station file I need to convert it into a shape file because it is not a shape file you have to first convert it into a shape file before you can proceed with a joining and to do this you click on, right click on it click on export save feature as an SG shape file I want the name I want the name to be saved as um, KNMI station so that's what I want it to be and one other important thing is the coordinate ref reference system of the data which I'm working with the data has a coordinate reference system of this so I don't need to do anything to it again but if your data of which I'm very certain that your, yours will not will not have the same as mine in that case you need to search for the CRS of your data from the filter section here and then you can use it so it is very imperative to search for it and then input it here before you proceed with it so I have to just the format the file name and the CRS column and then that is fine for converting it into a shape file I have already created this file that I've already done the conversion but for the sake of this demonstration I will overwrite it so you can see that it successfully saved vector layer as a shape file okay so I have now successfully converted it I can check to see if truly this is a shape file okay so you can see that it is dot shp so I can delete this one not delete but remove the layer just to make our work a bit um, clearer for us to proceed okay so that is it now I'll be adding the temperature to the station table that's the attribute table and so to do this I right click on the station file click on properties now when you look at these you could see that we have a join option there so you click on the join option and then this which is the add new join you click on it as well so you now have a new dialog box opening alright now the join layer we are interested in joining the temperature layer and the join field is the station is the station that we want to join and the target field as well is the station okay so kindly take notice that it is the temperature file that we want to join to the station file that is why we select the join layer as the temperature and when I open the attribute table at the initial stages for the two we realize that they had 
station as the common variable so the join field is the station and the target field as well is the station okay so what I need to do here is I have to choose which field I will be joining and that is the temperature field so I can now customize the field name now term it as temperature and then I can click on OK alright I will now click on apply OK and that is it to find out if it has been joined I right click on my stations open attribute table maximize it and you can see that initially for my station attribute table I had only station altitude and name but after joining I have now added the temperature which was in the open in the attribute table for the temperature file I have added it to the station file so that's how simple it is to join attribute tables in QGIS thank you very much for your time and uh, if you have any challenge if you have any problem just share your comments down there and I will check it up and if you need my help I will comment on it as well thank you very much have a nice day bye bye